All right, let me see this gameplay, man. Let me get into it. Oh, snap. Yeah, so I'm checking out the content, man. I want to see how the gameplay is. I haven't, haven't really, like, seen it properly. Oh, snap. Should I by you embrace danger? Round one. Fight. So okay. this is a Mortal Kombat game, so you expect the fighting to be brutal. MK11 sees the return of Baraka, who was a fan favorite from Mortal Kombat 2. So let's see some of the moves he does here. Yeah, he, has he been in like I don't think he was in the last one. Yeah, I don't think he was. Those things I have, I have more come at XL, but I haven't played in a bit. Okay, okay. now without getting too technical, we're gonna get into some of the geeky fighting game uh, moments out there. Mortal Kombat, traditionally we've had one meter that's a shared resource amongst the offense, defense, and the super moves. Mortal Kombat X is separating all three of those. So we have a horizontal meter is the offense attacks, vertical meter is the defensive attacks. See, this is this is how you do guides, the basic ones, basic to pro, to take note. Without getting too geeky, like he said. Without getting too geeky. Extend this leg stab here into a throw with a also. So this in here is going to escape a from a knockdown using his defensive meter. So the two bars. And you're gonna notice here that the uh, fatal blow is that's actually tied to 30% of the of the health meter when it's I don't know how I feel about the bars. This adds completely new dynamic and tension to the fighting. Both in Baraka and Scorpion have a fatal blow right now. So Scorpion missed his fatal blow attack, but it actually will regenerate after a cooldown period. So you notice his, his fatal blow is established, he can pull it off. Okay, so they use they use the fatal blow as like rage now. Okay. Ooh. Lord, how am I still alive, bro? And of course, it wouldn't be Mortal Kombat without fatalities. Um, they love it. They love it out there. That's crazy. We're gonna quickly talk here about we have custom variations on this player variation screen. The players can create, modify, and collect multiple versions of every character. There are a ton of features that you can customize. Okay, that's custom sick. Pieces, the intros, the victories, as well as a huge variety. You of can customize characters. intros. Every, every fighter has three costume pieces. You see, Scorpion. They're changing the mask here. Oh. Like the old school one. Attributes. Okay. See, we're swapping out the spear or the katana for. A oh snap! And of course, Scorpion's iconic spear can be swapped out for one as well. Nah. It's mad. <laughs> it's mad. Whoa. What the hell? But 
they, they went they went ham with this. This is the case with all the fighters. So you're gonna know a Scorpion and Barack, all the kind of variations you're gonna see, you know, playing people online and whatnot. second fight here is Sonya versus versus Scarlet who was a returning character from Mortal Kombat 9 looking for me Scarlet a few pints of blood is all I ask trust me I'm not your type round one fight both Sonya and Scarlet return with their classic moves as well as some new ones Sonya has a bunch of gadgets that she can Whoa. play with here while Scarlet has her signature blood attacks. The game is crazy. We're going to take a look at some of the nuances we have. We have a new feature called a flawless block. A perfectly timed block will open a window for countering attacks. Oh, so it's like a... Scarlet doing a quick what do you call it? It's like a V-reversal for like Street Fighter Five. That's kind of sick. Yeah, you're dead. Yeah, so they got like a V reversal. That's quite sick. So that when you were getting rushed down, you could just kind of like reverse it. Ooh. I like the stages. The stages look nice. Fatal blow ready so she can take release. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, whoa, whoa, <laughs> oh, my gosh, what it? I Grenade, right? Which is enough to win the match. Bruh. You might have seen a glimpse of this fatality here. This game looks mental. Plows on. Yeah, I don't this game is mental. So that's a little piece of Mortal Kombat 11, but I, I'm guessing maybe you guys want to see some fatalities a little more. more. It's mad. Okay, this game is looking play very, play very play good. Play. I'm not going to lie. This game is looking. This game is looking really good. Oh my lord, man! I think. I think we're gonna leave that there. <laughs> There's a lot going on. There is a lot going on. But for, they haven't even announced all the characters yet. But for there's just a small, um, small few characters that they have and the fatalities and stuff, it looks like they put a lot of effort into the game. And they're showing that you can customise things as well in terms of like the costumes and you know the, the weapons that they have and stuff like that. Uh, and you can change the ones that they have. I think that's really, really good. So if Liu Kang, I hope they put like, you know, Liu Kang before he died. And then that. They've done the zombie Liu Kang in one of the uh, thingy. Or was it the undead look at whatever? I would like to see that. But yeah, no, I'm not <laughs> this game is I'm looking forward to playing it. I'm looking forward to playing it. Cause I didn't get to play it at the reveal because I was just like looking around and stuff, but yeah. This game is looking kinda of, mm, it's looking mad, so 
I mean, yeah, we'll see how it goes, man, for sure. And yeah, if you want more content like this, like I said before, leave a comment in the comment section down below. Make sure you lot, um, you know, subscribe to support. And yeah, I'll be back with more more combat content. Take it easy, everyone. Peace.